pandemic has certainly taken a toll on many farm and farm workers. One of the biggest problems is getting those goods into the hands of customers. But now there's an app for that. Reporter Malik Jackson shows us how a local farmer is turning to technology for help. Never stops feeding, uh, bedding, animal care and comfort. Uh, and then coming over here and bottling milk. A full-time job that Brent Stukesbury and his family have been doing for over three decades. I've been raised on this dairy farm my whole life. My dad started milking cows here in 1986. Stukesbury then decided not only to milk the cows, but bottle their own milk. Once the pandemic hit, empty shelves became the norm. Stukesbury's dairy creamery had high demand, but no way to get that in the consumer's hands. I can't distribute milk quickly enough and to far enough places. If you're two or three counties over, I, I can probably never get to you. Insert market wagon. Their goal, helping local farmers get their products in the hands of real people, says CEO Nick Carter. Giving farmers and food artisans direct access to the consumers who want to buy their food as well as allowing the farmers to build relationships with their customers. We're establishing with the technology that we've built the same kind of connections that they would like to have at a farmer's market. We have people following their favorite vendors. We can receive updates. There's a social experience. You can chat and message back and forth directly with the farmers. A way forward for Stukesbury, maintaining the foundation of their work that they've spent years working toward. It'll just keep helping me and my family be able to live and run this business. In Jefferson City, Malik Jackson.